and welcome you to the Stylist Corner. Today in this video, I will be showing you how to do a bang trim on yourself when you can't make it into your stylist in time. Because obviously, going to your stylist is always your best option. So, anyway, hope you enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. So, you've just gotten out of the shower and um, you've got your bangs hanging in your face. Um, the best way to be able to tell what your bangs are and what they aren't so that you don't cut too much off mm -hmm. is, um, is brushing your hair back and letting you know the natural bangs fall, mm -hmm. shaking it out, um, and then brushing your hair through it, getting your natural part going on, mm -hmm. and, uh, and then I always have a pretty clean part up here for where I take your bangs from. It's never a point on you. Some people I take it from a point like that coming down. That's just not the way done on you. Mm -hmm. The other thing that you have to watch is that your sides come out pretty far mm -hmm. um, in the temple area. So you just want to make sure you don't get those in it. And so you just want to grab whatever is long. Mm -hmm. I know I've already cut half of it. This half I haven't cut yet. Um, and if you see any extra long hairs, you just kind of grab them and try to separate them and pull them back. And then, do you have scissors? Here, cutting scissors uh, of any sort? Yeah, you, you can go to Sally's and get some. I would pay about $25 for a pair of okay? Anything cheaper than that um, is going to be pretty bad. Anything more than that, we're going to give up some quality unless you go really bad. So, um, so anyway, just make sure that you have a pretty even line across the front and that you're not tying in anything in the temple area. So if it stops, you can tell you know, right before it gets to your temple area. And you know what I mean when I say temple area. So the best way to do this is to bring it all forward. Um, and it may not seem 100% equal on both sides. Your hairline is a little different over here mm -hmm. um, and it doesn't always take as much hair. So you're going to have a thinner amount of hair on this side. Mm -hmm. And that's okay because you wear it to this side. Mm -hmm. um, so the best thing to do is to take it and twist it slightly. And then once you get it, um, you never, you want to go to have the length be about um, where your nose, like, before it starts to go down, so right about there is probably a good, and then you take your scissors, and instead of going like this, straight across, you actually want to use the tip of them, like this, and it will push some of it, you just keep it going about right where your nose is. Okay. You can look at that length, and it's still long, right? Mm -hmm. But it's better, way better to start long than to cut too much off and go, oh crap, now it has to grow. <laughs> okay? So, and, and then we're going to take off about another half an inch, okay? And we're going to point cut again. The awesomest way to do this is to stand over your sink and put a small garbage can in there. And as you're doing it, you're just cutting it right into the garbage can. Okay, and yes, open your eyes. Those are long, but you have to remember that you sweep them. And so that's probably about the right length. So use right about where your nose starts to go down as your first guide. And then from there, you can decide if you want to go just a little bit shorter. If you're too afraid to, keep them longer. You can always cut a little bit more off the next day if you decide I can't stand this length. Um, and I wouldn't do more than that. I would just let it be until you can see me again because any other touch-ups that you try to do might mess it up. So I do more than that. Um, like I go through now and, and uh, texture it a little bit, cut into there so that it's just a little softer. But just to get the initial length off and get it out of your face, that's probably the best way to do it. Well, I hope you got some value out of this video, and if you did, if you could give me a thumbs up and subscribe, that would be greatly appreciated. Thanks so much, bye. Mm -hmm.